Hey YouTube, Mark Hoffman here with another video, and I wanted to talk about the Rough Rider Cam King. This knife um, was reproduced, and the name was acquired by Rough Rider, um, and was reproduced by Rough Rider Knives, aka Smoky Mountain Knife Works. And we have Tobias Gibson to thank for that over at um, Knife Chats with Tobias. He kept asking for one of these and they finally made one. Now we can see here we've got a nickel silver shield there. We've got black bone handles. Um, mine came out more brown than black. And then on this end, this came out black. So a little uh, matching um, discrepancy there, but you know, it's, it's a $15 knife. We have a nice big nickel silver bale here. We have stainless steel springs with brass liners. Then we have our standard camp knife affair. We have a nice big can opener here with a little bit of a bend in there for, to make room for the other tools. And then we've got a cap lifter screwdriver here with half stop. And then we've got the nice big pen blade. So uh, not pen blade, spear point blade. So this blade is um, 440A steel, um, which I've had no problem using or sharpening. Um, this one is the one I use. I bought two because I wanted one in my display case. So I have two of these. Blade's great. Spring on the blade is it eh, could be better and then we have our awl now i'll be honest the grind on the awl isn't that great you can see that it doesn't go all the way to the end so a little disappointing there half stops on everything uh fit and finish on this is really good we've got a little bit of a space there a little gap gap you know, but it's a fifteen dollar knife, so I'm not complaining. The one thing I will complain about is the cap lifter. This is not the easiest cap lifter to use. Um, the the angle that this is protruding out at makes it very hard to actually grasp the cap. So there's too much here for you to actually get to the cap and pry. Um, not the best. Uh, you can do it. You can also just take the bottle and just boop, pop it that way. Um, but that kind of defeats the purpose of having a cap lifter on this thing. But yeah, it's a nice knife. I enjoy having it. I was more excited about it being actually just reproduced than it being a fantastic blade. The originals were not the best quality um, cap lifter on those actually worked though. I have quite a few originals and I have a new old stock one. Not in the case, but it's just never been used. So I will be doing a video on the old versus the new and the many renditions from other companies that did a camp style knife um i i say style because the i mean camp knife there's been so many renditions of it and uh, varieties of it so um i will be doing a video on those i have a camco i have camillus i think i have camillus and i have the oh the name is escaping me but you'll see it in a few videos from now but thought you guys would enjoy seeing the camp king by rough rider knives um, the knife itself is a great knife just the cap lifter is the main problem so a little just a little disappointing with that but other than that it's a wonderful knife to carry and it's much thicker than the original but i hope you guys enjoyed seeing this one in for review and discussion uh, I have a few other videos that I'll be uploading after this, so I hope you enjoy those, and I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you so much for joining me.